Welcome to Kenneth. In this video, we're going to go over how to diagnose some AC problems on a Volkswagen. Now, let's say you have an AC system that doesn't blow uh, cold air, or maybe you have an AC system where it's blowing cold air on one side, hot air on the other side, and you're not sure what's going on. So, what you'll need is you'll need, let's say, the Ucanic scanner, for example, that you can use. And then, what you'll do is once you turn this on, you go down to Volkswagen. You got all the makes and models that this scanner will work with. But we're interested on in Volkswagen and then uh, right here you go you can enter the model and year manually or you can do smart VIN so what that will do is we'll pull the VIN number of the vehicle and then determine the year make and model uh, we're here we're working on 2014 Volkswagen Tiguan press OK select diagnostics quick scan will go through all the control modules in the car and tell you what's wrong with them basically but we're interested in the so these are all the different control modules on this car. But we're interested, we're going to go to control modules and select the 08 Auto HVAC control system. So here we can read the codes from this control module. But there's no codes, but that's okay. We're going to do some more troubleshooting. and go to live data, all data stream, select all, press OK. And now here we can look at all the sensors. We can start the car, we can see if the clutch is engaged, we can see temp um, pressure sensor for the AC system, we can see values from that, maybe it's reading zero, you know, things like that. So I'm going, there's a lot of things you're gonna look, everything that, every sensor that sends data to the AC control unit is gonna uh, display on that screen. Uh, but we can go a step further. We can do things like force the AC clutch to engage we have these um, flaps that basically direct the air, hot air, and they mix the air cold and hot, or they might direct it up and down and things like that. So you have all these different uh, monitor, this um, uh, flap uh, sensors basically that direct the air. Uh, you can actually test those, you can activate them. You can activate uh, those motors for that. You can activate AC clutch, AC compressor. So. You can start the car and then you can go ahead and activate this. Um, you don't want to run it for too long. So you can you can do a lot of testing with this scanner. This is what uh, B-Directional Support does. That we, we are actually using the scanner to engage different motor, different um, sensors or whatever. So this is very good for troubleshooting because then you can eliminate the issue. Um, you can determine, oh, is it... Uh, Maybe it's the relay that's not working, or maybe it's the switch itself that's not working. But if it's working when you activate it here, that component is verified that's working. Now you got to look for the issue between basically, let's say, your switch and the AC compressor, you know. So, and, and these, you can activate all of these. Without, I can hear that. You can hear that on the background. Activating on and off. So that's it. Um, this uh, tool is, uh, of course, can troubleshoot any problem on Volkswagens and other makes as well. But uh, in this case, we demonstrated how to further diagnose AC problems on a Volkswagen on a system that is fully charged, but you're not sure why it's not working. Thank you for watching Mechanic, where you can be the mechanic.